What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel for another Florida vlog. Today, most importantly, we are celebrating our seven year anniversary of being together. She has tolerated me for seven years. <laughs> <laughs> and we are here at Disney Springs. We have a reservation for Boathouse at 6 o'clock. Pretty early. It's 1 o'clock right now, but we're going to walk around. My wife needs shoes, actually, because she just has, like, sandals, and they're not going to be good for her feet. So we're going to go look for some shoes here, walk around, explore Disney Springs. It's our first time here, obviously. And, yeah, just have a good time. But come along with us on another vlog. All right, I guess we're going to go through security. Didn't know this was a thing. We're gonna go through the metal detectors and stuff right now. Man, I've seen this on video so many times. It's kind of crazy now to be here, <laughs> going down this escalator into Disney Springs. We might need to get a map or something because we have no idea where anything is. Pretty crowded today. I mean, it's Saturday, so you would expect it. It's beautiful here. Got the water. We're gonna go into this store called Havainas, Havainas, to see if they got anything that my wife could uh, buy. We went in there with the expectation of getting my wife some sandals. The sandals there are like $120 each. That's crazy. I'm pretty sure there's something special with them, but yeah, it's way out of our budget. We're not gonna spend $120 on some sandals right now. And right here, they got the Amphicar launch, which some people are about to go on right here. It's really cool. Not sure how much it is. We stopped here at Wetzel's Pretzels to get a Wetzel dog and a frozen lemonade. We've been walking around for a couple minutes. Uh, I must say it's overwhelming not knowing what anything is. Disney Springs is way bigger than I thought it was, so it's just uh, we gotta get adjusted to the area and kind of know where things are. And we're gonna be walking around after this. We just wanted a snack because we even had we haven't even had breakfast or anything like that. And our reservation for dinner is till six o'clock. Yeah, it's a lot of cool cool buildings here, a lot of cool stores. But like I said, it's just huge, and not knowing where you, where to go is kind of overwhelming sometimes. But yeah, we're gonna eat our snack here, and then we'll continue exploring. So we got our. Wetzel dogs here with some nacho cheese. Well, I'm sorry, you enjoying it. 30 bucks though for <laughs> these two dogs and, and a frozen lemonade. Kind of pricey. Came into this store called uh, Candy Cauldron. It was cool. So they have a bunch of uh, candy, popcorn, and all the candy that you might want right here. And that's the price right there. One fourth of a pound, three fifty. Half a pound, seven. Three fourths, ten fifty. And one pound, fourteen dollars. Look at that, <laughs> big lollipop. <laughs> and they had this big Splitsville. I'm guessing it's like uh, bowling, L luxury lanes. Uh, they got an M&M store over there. I think we're gonna check out the M&M store right here. Look at all these M&Ms. Once you come in here, you get a, a basket so you could not be carrying everything in your hands. Wow, I love Disney Springs. Not bossy, just a boss. Get all this merch, all this Eminem merch. Got some shirts, some cups. I think it's like a, a journal or something right there for 10 bucks. And they got every color. Mini shape M&M's right here. More cups, some hats. That one's cool. They got some pretty cool uh, hoodies over here. Look at this red one. Wow. And that one is $49.99. 50 bucks. Fanny pack. Some sweats, those are pretty cool. They have like the side strip. This is M&M's, Disney Springs M&M's. That and that probably go together. Here is all the M&M's. These mugs, two for 30. Got all sorts of colors. It's a cool looking uh, building here. House of Blues. It's a gift shop or, because there's tickets over here. 
I'm pretty sure we could probably check out the gift shop by itself. It smells good in here. Oh, they got the incense. How's the blues shopping tip? Avoid bad karma, don't steal. <laughs> they got all sorts of gear here. Hats, shirts, and the house of blues. Right here it says, can, can I mix you a drink from T-Pain? <laughs> from crook to cook, Snoop Dogg. We're gonna go here, check the Cirque du Soleil store. Probably how they painted the characters. That's uh, what's the name of that movie? I'm blanking right now. Um, the Jungle Book. It's a made of paper. Oh, and then the necklace is made. Oh, look, the necklace is made of uh, paper clips. Okay, we just got out of the store called Sonic or Sanic to buy my wife some shoes. She ended up getting these right here because her feet were hurting from the sandals right there. So she got these and they got like this memory foam in there and she said that they're very comfortable. Here is the popular Gideon Spake house. I'm pretty sure there's a line right now. Yep, although it's not too bad actually. Not too long of a line. At the Lego store. Look at this, look at this dragon here. <laughs> wow. And then over here, got another dragon here in the water. And we're not eating here, but look at this T-Rex restaurant with this big skeleton dinosaur yeah, yeah they even have this car right here Ooh, they even got a little play area a little sand area for kids and then over here they got another t-rex here skeleton we're gonna go inside the gift shop and see if we could explore a little bit A bunch of dinosaur toys here, bracelets, all kinds of souvenirs here. Look at these keychains. <laughs> Look at these uh, dinosaur eggs. And then right here is like the bones of the dinosaur right here that, that you go through. And then they got a build a bear workshop based on uh, dinosaurs to so build a dino. like big boat right here it's paddlefish I believe it's a restaurant if I'm not mistaken that would be a cool experience to eat in a ship or a boat and okay, we're gonna go into the coke building here and check it out and see what they have oh, so fresh in here got all this coke merch made from recycled bottles. It's nice, yeah. I would wear that, or even the white one. Or is it reversible? 134. Got some hats as well. Coca-Cola's hats. Drink Coca-Cola in a bottle. Now we saw old school. Coke merch. Got the thermometer, they got the cap right here. A big bottle. <laughs> Let's pretend there's something in there. <laughs> got these like aluminum ones right here. Eight dollars for the $7.95. Trays, buckets, pillows. Look at these shiny ones right here. These are the month. Every month has what's mine? My birthday's in June, so that would be well, this one right here. And then this is Sophie's February, and then Desi's is in May. 
and then white piece is October. I'm not sure what these are right here. They have a little hole. $4.95, but yeah, I don't not sure what these are. Wifey likes this one right here. $7.95. Right here you got a reusable pocket straw. I've never seen one of these before. They also got some Sprite merch and Fanta because you know they're owned by Coke. So they got Coke Cherry. Cherry Coke, I mean, and Diet Coke. What did we do wrong today, honey buns? <laughs> we came a little early. <laughs> a little? <laughs> a little early. Um, so our reservation at Bow House is at 6 o'clock. Right now it's about to be 5. But we've been here since like 1 in the afternoon. I guess we thought we were going to need 5 hours of <laughs> walking around before our reservation. We've just been sitting around from time to time. We've been getting up, walking a little bit more, and then sitting down again. Yeah, this was not the wisest decision, but hopefully it pays off. Hopefully dinner pays off. We were looking at the menu earlier. I think we're going to get some steaks there at Boathouse. And yeah, hopefully you got to have a nice anniversary dinner after all this. And then I think after this, we're going to go over to the hotel and get in the, in the pool to just relax because we need it. We've been here just walking in the sun, resting whenever we can. But yeah, we did a big mistake by coming here like five hours early. Uh, it's time for us to come into the boathouse here. Pretty cool looking uh, restaurant from the inside. Of, obviously it's called the boathouse so it has a lot of boat parts. And they got this boat right here which is really cool. Right here they have a gift shop. Got all sorts of parts and, and ducks. <laughs> Uh, t-shirts in here all sorts of things related to boats and a boathouse keep your eyes on your own bobber right here they got like a fish some necklaces some anchors by the way look at my shirt I think it's appropriate uh, thank you we got a view of the water right here and our, li our little friend right there. <laughs> oh, That's a nice view. We picked outside because it's nice and fresh. Alright, we're going to look at the menu and I can already know what we're going to get. Although I know this is technically a seafood restaurant. I'm not, I don't enjoy seafood but I also hear that the steaks are really good as well here so I'll be getting a steak and I think my wife will be getting a steak as well. We have brought over the famous bread that they have here, dinner rolls here with some butter. We give this a try. We tasted the, the bread, it was really good. What did you think honey? Good? It was delicious now. It is kind of pricey here, like, uh, but you know, we don't do it often. It's our anniversary. That's why I decided to take my wife here uh, for today. Um, so, but you know, I'm, I heard good things about the food. The bread so far is really good. I got a filet mignon and my wife got a New York steak with fries. I'm gonna give you guys the review of that. But yeah, it's a little bit pricey, a little bit more than uh, we usually spend. But like I said, we don't do this often, so it's okay. And it's for our anniversary anyway. So, uh, might as well, you know, we treat ourselves once in a while. Uh, we finally got our food after like 45 to an hour of waiting. Uh, but I got the filet mignon right here with some potatoes. And my wife got the New York steak with some french fries. And we also got some mac and cheese to share. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and try this steak for the mignon right here. It's good, and then the potato here. Yeah, we're good. Yeah. Thank you. Wow, these potatoes are so good. The steak is good. I mean, like I said, we waited about 45 minutes to get our food here, but it's really good. Taste one of these fries. You know, it's dark out here. They brought us the little lamp. It's a nice touch. This mac and cheese, by the way, was really good as well. Still working on my steak. One potato left. My 
Sophie over there still looking at hers. All right, I finished my steak, my potatoes. Wife is still working on hers. And the mac and cheese, we're still working on. We're probably gonna take that home because I'm stuffed and wife is probably stuffed almost as well. We just got out of the boathouse. Food was delicious, it was really good. We did have to wait almost like an hour after being sat down. So luckily we had a reservation. I actually made a reservation like two months ahead. So right when we get there at six, we were seated within five minutes, but we did have to wait like an hour to get our food because it's a super busy place. Food was good. Uh, will we do it again? Maybe, but probably not for a while. <laughs> you know, because it is pricey, it is expensive. And now that we're out, it is super crowded out here. There's a lot more people than when we went into Boathouse. I mean, it is a Saturday night, so you could expect that. But um, yeah, we're gonna try to make our way out of here somehow. There's a lot of people. Just head out of here now. But um, it was a good time here at Disney Springs. So I think we're gonna go get some ice cream. I'm gonna get some gelato. So I got some chocolate. Probably got Cookie Monster. And we're just gonna eat this and head back to the car. We are back in the car. That's gonna conclude this Disney Springs slash seven year anniversary vlog. What did you think about the boathouse, honey? It was delicious. Mm -hmm. And go outside. The yeah. outside has the best view. Yeah. And the yeah. ice cream. I it was I, delicious. I was trying to see the sign of what it was called, but it's right next to Wolfgang Puck's uh, restaurant. So it's like connected to it, so that one. Um, but yeah, it was really good. It was really rich, really creamy. Mm -hmm. So one of the best ice creams we've had. So it was a good, good thing we got it here. Now. I got the monster, the monster cookie. Cookie monster? Cookie monster. Yeah, and I just got the basic chocolate. I'm just a basic type of guy. But he doesn't like exploring too much. No, or fruity stuff. I don't like getting into fruity. But anyways, we're just gonna head, head back to the hotel, relax for the rest of the night. Uh, but thank you guys so much for watching this another adventure here in Florida. If you guys liked it, do me a favor, hit the thumbs up button. Consider subscribing if you want to see more of these vlogs while we're here in Florida. And we'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace. Mm -hmm.